Dreams Real, a distinguished Toastmaster club, area, district, division, and district. Master Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters, honored guests if we had any. It is my pleasure to unveil and introduce District 10's new marketing display. The purpose of this brief presentation is to do three things. Describe the marketing display features and benefits. Describe the high performance leadership team approach and describe your use and sustainable role. This is a picture of the tabletop display as it will be displayed, as it's displayed in the corridor or the front of the conference for this district in uh, conference this year. The concepts of this display is that it's a three panel display. Each panel to the right and to the left are on hinges tied to the center panel, which allows you to fold that in any way to fit whatever table surface you have it on. The, table, the cover below the table design is for an eight foot table. I've had a couple of experiences recently in prototyping this and taking it into the marketplace and had to display it on a round table at the Ashland Public Library, which is only four feet wide. So there will be obstacles that we will have to face, so we need to be prepared. But this is the essentially the major parts of the display. The top part is the new Toastmasters logo with the Toastmasters colors. A lot of work, a lot of research has gone into that. The center panel is a universal benefits message and is designed to be workable in a corporate and a public setting. It is a base message. However, you as a club, you as an area, and you as a division have the option of modifying that because that display message can be removed and replaced with something that you want to put there instead. Well, the other thing I want to point out that this does have the QR code. So anyone visiting the site, looking at it, can walk up, take a picture of that code, and go directly to Toastmasters International website. For that reason, we're recommending that you not waste a whole lot of money on brochures and papers and things of that nature unless you particularly want to take people to the uh, to the website directly. If you like. The left panel communication is a communication track. That message as well is a universal generic message. However, it is removable from that left panel, and you can put your own message up there as you wish or modify it to customize it to your specific marketplace and your specific event. Also on the right panel, that is the leadership track. Likewise, it can be removed and customized to fit your, your particular event and situation. The other thing I want to point out on each of these panels on the back side is a whiteboard. So if you're in a meeting and you want to feature the communications track and want to be writing on the other side, you can turn this in on the hinge and use the whiteboard on the back of the leadership panel and use that as a whiteboard and making notes or describing whatever it is you're talking about and vice versa. This is a table topper. As I said, it is for an eight foot table and it has, it's in black and it has the Toastmasters International logo. This is what the display looks like sitting on a table wherever you would choose to do that. Fortunately, with the fact that it's on hinges, you can set it on a four foot round table or as I came the last time for you to put it on this table here and use it. What you will see if you, as you go out into the lobby where the display is sitting right now, there will be a video recorder so that people can just, you can present Toastmasters in action. And you will see that when you go out into the foyer or wherever this is displayed. 
and see that city. The approach that I took in beginning to put this together came about in two major steps. One, Greg Cliff participated in when I had found an opportunity to participate in the Main Street, North, North Cape Main Street uh, Festival, and a group of us got together very quickly, almost in 24 to 48 hours, and created a one hour, two hour display and attended that and, and were there to attend that. Shortly after that, or about the same time, is when Dave Wiley, who's the district governor, was saying, we need to have a display we could use throughout the district. So those two th thoughts kind of came together at the same time, and we stepped up and said, we will we'll do this. Particularly since we have tremendous resources such as Mike and Dan and Rose and so forth to do this. So that is the high performance team on the left that came together with the help of Dave Wiley at the district level who connected into internationally to get approvals for this to help us and work through the process and the structure that is shown on the right hand side. As we progressed, we went through these major steps in order to prove out the ideas and thoughts that we came to mind as we worked together in meetings and to, to, to make this possible. This District 10 November Conference introduction is the completion of what I call the initial step. The implementation decisions and actions that we have taken include this concept presentation feedback that we got from the District 10 or District DEC meeting, as well as at this club, as well as at the uh, at the Ashland uh, Toastman uh, speech contest. But the thing that we'll be carrying on is the sustainability responsibilities, which includes the logistics management, the user policies and budget, maintenance policies and budget. <laughs> Those things will be available directly on District 10's website. There will be also a calendar on the District 10 website where you as a club can go in and schedule your use of this display. What we need from you in carrying out your sustainability responsibilities and roles is to go out and look at the display in the foyer, discuss it among yourselves, reflect on what you see there, and begin to generate your own ideas of how you will use this. Feed back that information to the current high performance leadership team and the district leadership. If you want to communicate directly with me, there's my phone number and there's my email address that you can communicate your ideas and suggestions on this. We have already received suggestions and requests for additional displays, perhaps one for each division, and also certain club people have come up and said, can I have a smaller one that I could use for my club specifically? So there will be new ideas and fresh ideas about how to capitalize on this initial start of a display. So make your dreams real. Take your dreams, turn them into goals, turn them into actions, turn them into positive results, and go into your club area division marketplace and grow to become a distinguished Toastmaster. <laughs> <laughs>